Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Taurus? How is everyone doing? This is your late night energy reading. Happy, well, it's now Tuesday probably, but I hope you all had a, having a good start of the new week, okay? I love you guys. Thank you so much for your likes and sharing my content. As you all know, if you haven't read the community board, I have switched shifts in my position. I am now on first shift, but nothing has really changed. I just have to get my my sleeping pattern together, okay? So I'm so many days on and so many days off. So it's not like I'm, you know, working first shift every day. So I have so many days. That's the good thing about it, okay? So I can still pour into y'all, still give your messages. I just ask you to just be very patient with me as I go through this transitioning of getting my sleep together. <laughs> okay. Yeah, challenging, but I love it. You know, um, I am... I, f I really feel, you know how when you make a change and you, <clears throat> and sometimes we can be pushed out of our element. Uh, I was so comfortable on being on that shift that I forgot to live, okay? And I was, you know, afraid because you're used to um, just being in your comfortable spot, your, w what you are familiar with. But sometimes it's good to just make a change, you know? And um, I feel like, you know, my mind, body and soul, something, a lot of things was going on at work. And it's like they're moving, moving managers around, moving people around, changing the shift hours. OK, so that's what put me in this mode of no, 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 no. I cannot go through this again. Uh, you know, getting off three, four o'clock in the morning. I, I, I'm, I'm done with that. OK, so I just want to I just want to be transparent with you and just share that with y'all, even though it may seem uncomfortable because you have been in one place or one position for a very long time. It's OK if that's what you like. That's what you like. But sometimes we can be afraid to step out because the fear of the known, unknown. Is it going to work out? Is it for me? Will it? You know, you know, what is it? You know, a lot of fear of, you know, of what's going to is any is this is a good move. OK, so like I say, that's for some people and some people it's not, you know, some people are fine because I was fine for for 17 years of being in on one on one shift. So, you know, I was fine with that until I just said, you know. I think um, sometimes the universe would make something uncomfortable for you to make you move. I say all this to say this, Taurus, is that sometimes we are pushed out of a comfort zone because there is something even better or greater for you. Now, I'm not saying, I'm not telling anybody to leave a job or none of that or change positions, but whatever the circumstance may be that, you know, a change is good sometimes, whether it's whatever that fits your life. I'm just, I'm just giving an example of my life. I'm being transparent about my life. Okay. Um, and it feels good. It really does, y'all. It feels really, really good. I feel like this is where I'm supposed to be. Okay, uh, this is this is the new year, the new shift in my life. Okay, so I love you guys. Yes, I took three minutes and 45 seconds of your time to new viewers, cross watchers. Okay, uh, but I love you guys. I do. I do love you. And I thank you for your understanding. Even I think all of you that have checked on me like, now, wait a minute. Miss Possible Thoughts and Energy haven't posted in three days. Like, and I just like that you really, you really care and you're in energy shows it all and I want to say thank you for just loving me and caring for me and th you know all of that good stuff so let's get started Taurus cha-cha-cha-cha-cha <laughs> cha-cha-cha-cha-cha cha-cha <laughs> blah 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 okay let's go Miss Positive Thoughts Energy let's go pick it up pick it up girl it is midnight after 12 o'clock. Uh, some of you are at work. Some of you just up. You're excited and all of that's good stuff. So let's see. So I'm going to pull from the fortune first. OK, I'm going to pull from your for fortune. Then I'm going to kind of pick up your energy and we're going to see what's going on with you. OK, so spirit guys, divine universe. This is for my beautiful Taurus. I love you guys. Did I tell you that? 
Oh, yeah, I love you. I love you. I love you. <laughs> so let's see. Let's see what we got here. We got celebration, transformation, and patience. And at the bottom of the deck is beware with my fortune oracle deck, okay? So I feel as though that what Spirit Guides is saying, a lot of you are going through a transformation, okay? You are definitely transitioning. OK, some of you uh, probably relate to what I was saying in the intro. You're relating to what I'm going through. Some of you are going through a transition in your life. OK, it says reach out for the power and strength to make changes, enrich your life and become the person you want to be. So some of you are definitely doing some transformation. OK, can you see that? Is that blurry? OK, some of you are definitely going through a transformation in your life. OK, uh, and you're getting ready to celebrate. All right. There's some good things. Twenty two break down to ten and ten break down to five. You know, there are some some ten ten. There's some good things coming for you. OK, you got the celebration here, Taurus. All right. Mm, get ready. This transformation, this this new journey that you're starting for some of you, if you're starting a new journey, uh, your new life, a new shift like I am, you're starting a new shift in your life. This is a good thing. This is a lot of you're ready to bring new and exciting things into your life because you're taking a chance. And let me hold this camera up some. Yeah, let's do this because you're taking a chance. OK, and you're seeing and you're and you're you're wanting you wanting something mm, fresh, something new. You want a new start. So a lot of you have going through this transformation and honey, this transformation is going to open up a lot of beautiful things for you. You see this this gift opening up a lot of beautiful things coming in for you. Spirit guides is saying just be patient. OK, slow down. OK, slow down, uh, change your attitude, change your perspective and clear your mind, because I know sometimes like I was telling y'all in my interest, sometimes when you make a change and you stepping out on faith and you're taking a leap of faith and you're taking a risk. OK, sometimes it can be scary. Sometimes it can be uh, like the moon card, the, the, the fear of the unknown. What if? What if? What if not? That's the question. What if not? OK, what if it does work out? What if it is for you? What if it is going to change your life? OK, so I also feel as though that some of you need to change your direction. OK, you need to change your direction. Um, take a different route. Do something different. This is a new year. This is 2023 when actuality, the new year starts in the springtime because that's when everything starts to bloom, start to blossom. But, you know, you know, put in your perspective, like this card said, your patience, you know, slow down, change your attitude and um, and clear your mind that this is good for you. This can be good for you. Okay. This transformation is sometimes what we need. I don't care what it is. I don't know your life. So whatever in whatever, what area you need it in, then it can be good. Okay. Cause sometimes we can, it was, you know, stay in one place was you become stuck. And like I said, it doesn't pertain. It doesn't have to pertain to a job. It could be anything. OK, uh, something that you're not doing, you know, uh, whatever. But it is definitely bringing this, this tra transformation. Mm, trying to talk. This transformation is going to lead you to a lot of abundance. Uh, you, this this shift that's going on that is taking place now that's going to prepare you in Excuse me. In the springtime around April, OK, uh, March, April, somewhere in there, it's going to pre prepare you. You're going to start seeing a lot of beautiful things that you have not seen before. OK, you have not seen before. And also the bottom of the deck is beware. It says be careful who you trust at this time because you're going through a transformation. You're going through something that you never have experienced before. And you do not allow anyone to persuade you or put into your mind that you sure that's what you want to do. You sure that's what you want to do. You sure that's where you want to go. You sure you. OK, so beware of who you trust at this time. Keep your energy high, your vibration high, your 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 intellect, your perspective positive, because you can have people that don't, you know, would try to downplay you and not want you to. And that can also make you afraid or also make you second guess yourself. Am I 
making the right decision. So beware of those type of people that may be trying to uh, make you second guess yourself. OK, because this transformation that you're going through, this transformation that you see, you're going through this cycle right now, of transforming. OK, some of you are in hermit mode, some of you are in just isolation. And this is the winter time. So this is hibernation. But about round March, OK, is when you're about to start seeing, uh, yeah, a lot of things that's going to open up and in your life okay uh, you also got the bottom is unity is here as well okay you're going to start maybe you're going to come in uh, contact with a new connection in your life or not only a connection but just more like-minded loving people such as yourself unity coming together okay a time of understanding renewal this is all about renewal this is all about transitioning this is all about preparing yourself to be trained transformed into something beautiful, just like a butterfly. The butterflies come out at about March, April, right? You're transforming. Right now you're in your cocoon. I need you to understand what it is that you're going through, okay? Because the crisis does not last long. This 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 darkness that some of you are feeling, it's not going to last long. It's just you're going through a transformation. You're breaking chains. Is I want it, 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 that's what I'm trying to tell you. You're breaking chains in your life. You're, you know, you know, chains that have held you back in the past throughout your life. You're breaking. See, as you see this, you're breaking. You're going to break these chains and you're going to reach out for the power and the strength that's that's within you to make these changes, enrich your life and become the person you want to be. In order, in, in other words, what my what my intuition is saying, you it, it's time to be free. It's time to live, you know, stop existing. Okay. You know, so unity is here and uh, you have, you know, so much. So let's see, Taurus. Wow. Okay. Let's see how you're feeling right now through all of this beautiful transitioning, this, this transformation that's going on in your life. A lot of power. OK, a lot of strength, a lot of courage, a lot of uh, taming yourself, a lot of confidence. OK, you have confidence. You're saying Miss Positive Thoughts and Energy. I'm ready for this new shift that is about to happen in my life because that's what's happening. There is a new shift. You're breaking chains. You're breaking uh, you're breaking generational curses. You're changing yourself. You're you're taking chances. You're taking a leap of faith. You're, you're, you're taking a risk. You're ready for this new shift in your life because this new shift is it's going to bring nothing but celebration, prosperity, abundance, happiness. OK, this is a gift. This is a beautiful gift that you're going to be so overjoyed and overwhelmed with it all till it's just like you, you're not going to believe it. Mm, tell me more, spirit. Tell me more for Taurus. Tell me more. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Reflection. Yes, reflection. Looking back. Um, you're going to look back. When you go through this celebration, when you go through this, 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 renewal, okay, this, this, this new you, this, this new vibration, this new everything, you're going to reflect back like, my goodness, I feel, I feel this change. Uh, I feel so good. And you're going to know, and it, it's just going to give your whole mind a different perspective on life. Okay. On, on what you've been, that you've been missing, even if it's just to, to smell the flowers or just to take a trip uh, and to, to just self love and just love on yourself and just, it's going to just make you look at life so much in a different islands okay so this is this is beautiful this is beautiful Taurus this is absolutely beautiful tell me more spirit uh, energy more energy yeah yeah I, I feel like it's giving you anxiety I really do. I feel like it's giving you anxiety. Okay. Because of your patience. Okay. Your patience. You're trying to be patient about, I feel like what this is telling me that it is, it is, and I can vouch to this. It is, uh, uh, the fear of the unknown. Like I was telling you, the anxiety keeps in like, I don't know because I went through it just three, three weeks ago, three weeks ago. I just, you know, when they started changing, uh, changing positions and changing things in within the uh, within the job, and it's like, 
oh my God, what am I going to do? So yes, I had anxiety. So I feel like some of you was having anxiety because of this change, because you're, you're being pushed out of your element is what I'm trying to say. And it's causing some anxiety and a little depression, like, uh, you know, and spirit guys said, just, just slow down. Okay. These two cards, this card, this card clarifies this card, the anxiety, the patience, slow down. Okay. Change your, change your attitude and clear your mind. OK, in other words, spirit, spirit guys, whoever your highest source is, is saying change your, you know, slow down, take a breath, take a breather, change your attitude, change your perspective. That's what it's saying. Change your perspective. Don't look at what may go wrong. Look at what's going to go right. I, oh, yeah, this is good for me. You tell yourself this is good for me. This is what I need. I will, you know, like I tell myself, I will, my sleep pattern will fall in place. I will, you know, I will succeed at this change. I will succeed at this change. I will succeed at this change. I would not have anxiety. I would just go with it. So sometimes you have to, it, it, when you do a change, a transformation, you're going to have to change your perspective, your mindset as well, because my mind is geared up to go to work at a certain time for the last 20 years. And now I have to change my mind, my program, reprogram my mind to shift differently, to shift into uh, this new reality that I have in my life. Okay. This new journey, this new shift that's going on. So yes, there is some anxiety with you. Okay. And energy, but you see, you have beautiful energy, a lot of energy. Okay. I feel like a lot of you have gotten a lot of rest. Okay, you, you're definitely resting. Your energy is good. You got the rest in the reverse, which tells me that your energy is absolutely beautiful. Okay, um, it's just that this is just something new to some of you. Whatever that transformation is in your life, that is what can give you a little anxiety because you're wondering if you're making the right move. Okay, but you're going to know it because it's going to feel right. It's going to fall right. Everything, whatever this transition, whatever this chain is that you're breaking, whatever it is, it's going to feel right when you walk into it okay now my first um my first my first oh my, my battery i thought it was charged um uh, my first uh a day was this weekend okay and um and it felt right okay it definitely felt right it felt good um and so you're gonna know it because you're going to get a sense of peace. You're going to get a sense of belonging. Okay. Your intuition is going to tell you, you're going to be at ease. Like, okay. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. All right. This can be good for me. You know, if you agree with that, just, you know, put in a comment, this could be good for me. There's the shift. Okay. So let's see, let's see what's going on. Okay. Mm, thank you, spirit guys. Those two just fall fell off of me. Okay. Yeah. Look at these two. Respond in faith. Okay. Respond in faith. Have faith. I have faith in myself and the universe that together we will orchestrate and manifest my heart's desire. So just have faith and believe this transition that you're going through, that you're going through or that you have already been through, that it is leading up to nothing but ab abundance in your life. And to respond. I respond to all situations, circumstances, events, and people with unconditional love and integrity and excitement. Meant. Okay. So let's see what you're reading is all about. I know I've done that differently because I wanted to see what state of what spirit guys have been, what state of energy that you're in. And then I poured your energy and it all makes sense to me, Taurus, that a lot of you are going through this beautiful transitioning, this, tr this transformation, breaking chains, doing something different. You, you're shifting. Okay. You're definitely shifting into a new, uh, yeah, timeline. Some of you are shifting into a new vibration, new energy. You're shifting. Okay. Because you got the energy card here. All right. You're shifting. And this is a beautiful thing. You got strength again. Double confirmation. Du two different decks. OK. A lot of strength, a lot of confidence. Some of you are really, really confident in this next move or this move that you're going through, this transformation that you're going through. You're very, very confident. 
You, you are very confident that this is what you need. This is exactly what you need, okay? Spirit guys, tell me more for the reading for Taurus, okay? Oh, this is what you need, baby. Oh, my goodness, when I tell you this is good for you. I don't know who you are, but this transformation is what you need. Prosperity, abundance, honey. Yes, this is a beautiful thing. Love, longevity, okay, payouts, inheritance, deeds, everything, baby. This gift, this box of gift is opening up to so much. This is what you need. Fear not, okay, Spirit guys just brought this, this scripture into my head. Fear not because of evildoers that they will soon be sh cut off like the green grass. I believe that's Psalms 91. Let me tell you something. This transformation is good for you because you're calling in. You're bringing in a lot of beautiful peace, understanding. You're bringing in a lot of, uh, a lot of, a good things, happiness in your life, peace, joy. Okay. This is a good shift. This is a shift that you need. Okay. You had to be pushed out of your element. You had to be pushed. Some of you don't understand why were you forced? You didn't want to leave because you had to be foot. You had to be pushed. Mm, 10 of Pentacles, baby. 10 of Pentacles. Tell me more for this reading. Tell me more for this reading for my beautiful Taurus. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Things are going to start happening fast with the Knight of Wands in this in this particular reading. Things changes is going to start happening quick for you. OK, you're going to start seeing your your manifestation. You're going to start seeing things just coming to you, coming to your changes. So because you made this change, this shift in your life, you're about to see some things prosper very quickly, very quickly in your life. Very quickly. Changes is going to happen very quickly in your life. I'm telling you, this is much needed. OK, a lot of healing, recovering from a lot of trauma. A lot of trauma in your past life up to now, breaking chains, ba breaking generational curses. You doing it. You did it. OK, and I know it can be scary. I'm here to tell you, but you break you. Look at that. Look at the chain breaking, baby. Look at the chain breaking. Read the card. Uh, 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 what is it? Snap the uh, screen, shoot it or have you want to talk about it but it says reach out for the power and the strength and honey you have the confidence you have strength twice in here transformation some of you a lot of you are ready for this shift you're ready for this transformation you're ready for this new year you're ready to to, to you say bring it on bring it on bring it on miss positive thoughts and energy put it in the comment bring it on bring it on because i'm ready i'm confident i'm ready for this shift i'm ready for this change i'm ready for my happiness i'm ready for my longevity i'm ready for it i'm ready where well, the changes is going to come in very fast because you have broken generational curse you have broken generational chains okay you have done it it was dark 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 but you have done it now it's time for you to shift you're shifting your reality your timeline, your vibration, you're shifting. And this is going to be good for you. I don't know who needs to hear this, but Taurus, baby. Look at here. Lovers is here. Lovers. Yeah. <clears throat> your twin flame, baby. Your twin flame coming in. Love's coming in. This is going to be good for you. You're going to be in love again, some of you. You're going to be in love again, not standing alone, not being by yourself, okay? Yeah, you got the moon card here, secrets, uh, moon card, the fear of the unknown, okay? Yes, it, it's an illusion. <clears throat> Let me tell you something. That's an illusion. Fear is an illusion. Fear, you have to change that mindset of fear. I am not fearful. I am fearless. I am fearless. I am ready for this shift in my life. I am ready for this transformation, this transition in my life. Yes, you have done the work. You have done the work. Congratulations, stars. Death card, rebirth, okay? Renewal, okay? Different timeline, this different shift in your life. You're not the same person. You have broken generational curses. You ought to be proud of your freaking self, baby. You ought to be proud of yourself. Any other message? Yes, you ought to be proud of yourself. You're sitting on your throne. You're the queen. What do you expect? You're the king. What do you expect? You are the one. 
You are doing it. You're ready. You're ready for this change. You're ready for this shift. I don't blame you, baby. I'm ready too. Tell me more, any more for this reading, spirit guys. Yes, it weighed on you very hard. But see, you never gave up. You, you, you kept putting one foot into the other. You were stressed, but you was you, you, you were still pressing your way through. Okay, you did it, baby. You did it. You're about to go into your new timeline. You're about to go into a new shift in your life, okay? You're about to have a lot of options. You're about to do a lot of things, okay? A lot of you getting over a very powerful heartbreak that broke your heart very, very uh, uh, badly. And you had to do a lot of soul searching. But the spirit guide, spirit teams is going to bring something in for you. It is destined for you, baby. Good luck, good fortune. The wheel is starting to turn. You're about to start to see yourself flourish out of this cocoon into a beautiful butterfly. That's a transition. I see this happening around March, April. You're about to start seeing yourself unfold. You're about to see the sky, the, the sun open up for you. This shift is good. This shift is good for you. This is shift. This is a good shift. I don't know who I'm talking to, but this is a good shift. I love you guys. Any other message for my beautiful, beautiful, <laughs> my beautiful Taurus. My goodness. Any other message? Mm, 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 mm. Told you the world card. This is a new chapter in your life. You released a lot of toxic energy. You released it. You broke the chains, baby. Congratulations. This is a new cycle out with the old. Guess what? In with the new. Yeah, absolutely. No more deceiving. You have awakened. You have awakened. You're about to go into your shift. You're about to shift. Your life is about to shift. All right. Yes, you've done it, honey. You have done it because of your patience, because learning how to pour into you, learning how to be you, learning how to just love on you. Let me tell you something. You're shifting and you have absolutely no idea what it's about to come into your life. This new chapter of your life because you broke the chains. My goodness, baby. I'm positive thoughts and energy. Taurus. Until next time.